Hey people, it's uh, Nam Day 4. I'm here with Shell. Yep. Isn't it Shell Lee or something? Shell. It's just Shell Waller. That's me. I'm, I'm doing the, you know, the Secret Service kind of talking into your wrist thing. Oh, where's my. Oh, no. What? Oh, black on black. Okay, we're gonna. Because I have my other mic in the. Whatever. Ah, because we're doing a stealth interview. And we also have the stealth power amps that are 1.2 pounds, one po that are 180 watts, true RMS, because all of our gear is rated in true RMS. And that is why Charlotte is the president <laughs> of ISP, because look at her pitch. Holy shit. <laughs> um, so I just told her that the only pedal I literally have paid for in the last six years is this. And you've seen it on my table in front of me. Because when I got my McMull guitars, and they're brilliant, but Tal McMull doesn't like to do... They're, they're vintage spec, which means every single pickup position hums and buzzes, which is fine when you're playing, but in between it can get annoying. And when I'm talking in between, which is of course your favorite part, <laughs> you, um, you don't want the... So I wanted something on the table that I can just use. And I have... I'll be honest, I have a couple of other noise gates. I have two from Joyo who I work with, and it's all good. But I know the one and only that you want is this. And you know I wouldn't bullshit you. So I did spend the full money on it and have it on, on my table in front of me, and 98% of the time it's on. And it's a pretty simple thing because it's just a knob and, a, and, a, and you push it and then it works. And you rarely, unless you want the longest sustain and really, really quiet things, can ever tell that it's even there. Now, there's other versions. Now, this one's the Decimator 2. Right. And we have the G-string. The Decimator G-string. Why in the world would it be called G-string? That's just, that's naughty. It is naughty. That's what we were hoping. We thought perhaps we would pack it with a G-string in every one, but we did not. We thought we'd get shut down. That would have that. been so cool. Yeah. Daring, but it would have been so cool. Well, you know, there's always hope. We could we could still maybe do that. You might find a surprise in one of your boxes if you get a G-string. Maybe let's do a limited edition. Oh, there you go. Let's That's do, a great let's, idea. Uh, let's do a, a G-string giveaway on my channel, and that one will actually have a G-string There you it. go. Sounds like a plan. That's what we'll do. Now we're talking. Now we're so talking. So this one, uh, uh, G-string is a little bit more complex because it's got dual ins and outs, right? Correct. So you put, the, you put wait, I don't know, but let me guess. You put your guitar in it, and then you go into your amp, and then later, in, maybe in the effects loop, you run through it again. And then it probably Correct. does some crazy thinking of like, okay, that was the signal, that's the signal now, before and after, phasing can, and comparing, and let's take the shit out that's not supposed to be there. Correct. That, that, was, a, that was a technical that was, explanation. That, and that's how I explain things as well. Just so technical. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's... The guitar players, they're very simple people. Yeah. <laughs> Some of them are, I yes. But yeah, the that's why the is, one knob is such a great that's idea. That's right. That's right. You can't mess it up too much. You just turn it until it quit makes and quits making noise, and then you're you're good to go. I see link so. in and link out. What am I linking that to? Uh, well, you can actually link more than one pedal together now. So if you have an even larger for stereo, so if you have a stereo rig, you can you can link in and out. So you can use this with a stereo. It's, cool. it's kind of like our Pro Rack. We have a Pro Rack Stereo G mod that the the players that actually run a stereo rig, will use, if they have a rack mount, they'll use the mod. If they have a rack mount and they want to pedal, they can use this with the linking function. You could also have fun and have one on the bass player and one on you. And once the bass player is playing, you're playing. If the bass player is quiet, you're fucked. <laughs> you could literally just, you know what? That would be a fun performance. There you go. The guys on stage muting each other with G-strings. That's right. Come on, that's a good video. That's a, I mean, it's stupid, but that shows right. what it I, can do. May, maybe we better do that as well. I mean, we'll, we'll do that. it's not, not sensible, right. but I have a feeling that you guys go for crazy shit like Oh, that. we do go for crazy. And actually, uh, there are tons of bass players that use this. We have harmonica players using decimators. We have piano players using decimators. We wait, have, wait. How is a piano noisy? It, if it's electric, they, ah, they can okay. put it in the signal. You so. could even, if you have actually, if you somehow find a way to go in it with a mic, and you have a real piano, you could actually probably use this as an instrument where you get like 
choppy sounds and you're actually cutting the attack on your piano. You could probably have an acoustic piano hard gated. I mean, gate, the way that we want these to work is we don't want to know that they're there. But you could use them that they're very apparent, you know, really dial that in, or wait, dial it back, no, dial it in, and then all of a sudden you have, you know, an actual gate as an effect. Why not? Right. It's not how it's designed, but why not? Yeah, well, exactly. And the, the beauty of it is it's not a traditional gate. It's not an on-off gate. It The magic is in the decimator uh, patterns that we have that track the signal of the instrument rather than just chopping it on, off, on, off, on, off. It actually tracks it so there's no loss of sustain. Uh, if you're doing staccato or whatever, it's not going to change the tone of your instrument. So this is a great pedal. If, if, it, if it, so it did, heavy. I wouldn't I wouldn't have it yeah. on the table. Plus it's so heavy, you can throw it at people if you get annoyed with them. And shut them up. Mm -hmm. So it actually gates them. Exactly. It's a people exactly. gator. Exactly. That is exactly it. And now you have it in, as the French say, le tiny. <laughs> La petite pedale. Yes, that's what we have. So we have, this is a fully functional decimate. Uh, we, well, we call it decimate. Um, it's fully functional decimator pedal. Decimate. Decimate. That is clever. Decimate. Yep. Cool. It's fully functional. And that will also be the same as the, the full-size G-string. And will come with, this will be for your loop. Because we just could not fit one more jack into something that small. So that has both the... In Wow. Yes. So that will be the same as this guy. Price point on this? I don't even know. It's so new. We're, we'll be shipping this in probably two to three months. Totally clueless, Cheers. Totally. totally, totally, totally. I, I am. I am. The, the brains behind this operation is actually filming us right now, so he would probably be better. But what the heck? This is eye candy right here. <laughs> this and this. Uh, absolutely. This I works. Mean, I, I kind of take second seat to you, but it's it's okay. I can, I can hang with that. I can hang with the being in, in your beauty. It's all right. Being in the I like it when I'm beauty. when I'm being trolled. That's awesome. <laughs> I love it. Um, but what some of you might not know that that ISP stands for much more than just not making a sound. There's also stuff that does make a sound. It, there is plenty that makes a huge sound. We have. We have power amps that are 1.2 pounds. Come over here. Buck, come over here. Fo he, follow us. Now, he's the one who can explain this better. However. However, it's, we, it, 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 I like to see you struggle. I, I am struggling, and I am truly struggling. Oh, by the way, there's there's Robert Baker over there. Oh, oh hey, my Robert God. Baker. I just want to play guitar. Oh, Leave me alone. You do understand that we do YouTube, and you have to present yourself, right? Uh, no, I'm, I'm working on using my pinky. Let's, let's watch Robert Baker play without his pinky and make fun of him. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> ha 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 Fine. I use it once. There you go. You play better without your pinky than me with, which means you suck. <laughs> what can you do? Uh, what? It's the, the kids, you know? I have no I have no chance against the hair, the beard. Oh, I heard um what's what's his face? Uh, where they from 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 a uh, guy from Bad Cat told a really good joke. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Was a, a, guy, a guy with a beard is just a guy without a beard having a beard. <laughs> you know what? I can confirm that is exactly that is, what it is. That is true, right? If, if that's not science at its like <laughs> pinnacle. It's so deep. It's like a, you know, a guitar is a, a bass, but it's a guitar. <laughs> and you've heard it here first. Um, play, play some of that. Wait, wait, what yeah, are yeah. we looking at? It's the Theta something something. What are we looking at? What's that product? I don't you know. know. Show that. This, this is a the Theta MSX. Um, it's a Michael Sweet signature version of our Theta. The, the Michael Sweet signature version. The Theta Musix. Yes, it sounds incredible though. <laughs> Like, 
it's not not too shabby. I know it actually it sounds very the cleans are really amazing too. Okay, I'm gonna go into oh well Adam Wait. just Adam wants us to do other once, stuff. Once, once to clean it Adam is dictating way. this video now. <laughs> I thought he was just like our camera biatch, but no, oh, he's no. dictating the video. <laughs> he's like freaking Adam! He, he knows who's in control. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? You're playing acoustic, but where's the acoustic? That is, oh, that is that's 80s freaking heaven that, right there. Let's let's go. That's not even the pedal. That's my fingers. I can make these sound acoustic. <laughs> Hold that chord. What the fuck? That's right. What is that chord? You're not playing the. You're not playing the. You're not playing the A string, right? No, no. Okay. No, I am. No, I'm not. No, you're not. It's a flat. So we got an A flat seven G. What the fuck are you doing, Baker? That's right. Can we tell you what the chord is? No. I no no. I figure this out. So, uh, you're playing the B, right? Yes. B F sharp, B F sharp, B flat, B flat. That makes no. That's a ma sure. would be a major seven F sharp, but then that's a. You know I can do this. I'm gonna be here all fucking day. Is that the root? No. Yeah. 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 Yep. Okay, then that's an A flat, a flat, uh, a flat a B, B flat, and B with a minor. Um. A flat minus seven nine. Yep. It's a six something. B. What are you doing? That's a B, and the E is a what the? Must be a B. No, what is that? It's an E. It's an E nine. It's an E nine. Yep. But the but the A, a flat minus seven nine. That that's that's a cool chord. I have it on video. I shall learn it and use it in every video and claim it's mine. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't know what that chord was. I just wanted you to figure it out for me. You fucker! <laughs> I had literally no clue. <laughs> <laughs> you like? Do you want to know what it is? You fall. You fall on got me. I have no clue what that. I've, I've wanted to know for years. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> You, you suck. <laughs> okay, um, Adam, come over here. Go down. Show the back of this. Go, go, no, all, go around. Go around. Go around. All the way to the ground. Show the back of this. Because I'm going to look at the back. So we have input level. We have an in. That's where freaking Baker comes in. And we have stage out. And we have direct out. Stage out to who knows what. Maybe an FR, FR or something. Phones. Little tiny phones and an aux in for your backing track pleasures. Volume pedal, expression pedal, and external switching. Very cool. Huge ass screen. Baker's trying to talk me up up there, which is very nice. Not a lot of controls. What, 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 he, Robert Baker's saying I'm going to lick something. Dude, you know when I lick something, it's mine, right? That's how it works. Well, I'm just giving them a heads up. That's how it works at NAMM. You lick it, it's mine. Um, I, I like three knobs, and that's it. They're probably pushies. No, they're not pushies. Are they? Nope. No? Turnies. Turnies. But how, how do I then... How do I program this then? Show you. Ah! We have steppies. We have steppies as well. Steppies and turnies. Ah, that's a huge-ass display. Um, do you have an editor for this? Uh, like a computer editor? Yeah. No. Nope. No computer editor. There's MIDI too. But it's solid. I mean, it's solid as a rock. Subaru, no. What, who did that? As a rock? Solid? No. What, what, who did that? What, what, what car company did that? Oh, wow. I have no idea. Ford? Like a, like a rock. That's Ford. Like a rock, you know? Chevy? No, it could be Chevy. It could be. I don't know. It's, it's 
It's definitely American. Why are we talking about that? I don't know. You started um, it. I started it. So I'm going to get up, uh, go back to Shell and Baker and say goodbye. Uh, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm I'm gonna to be ready. the same. Look, I'm, wait, well, I'm ready but, just in case you lick anything. You know the one, I mean, I, 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 I really like I really like the stuff you got on the booth. The thing I really want to take home is this. No, oh, why? No. Why? You're mine now. Oh, God. Forever. Uh, uh, worst name ever. Oh no! All right, this this name is completely out of control now. <laughs> Don't worry, not the first time. Not the first time. <laughs> yes, this is the fourth day. We can tell. Yeah, yeah. We all we're all going we totally nuts. Like day. over the edge, over the top. So um, I feel completely ridiculous with my little, with my little cape. Oh, it's okay. It's size doesn't matter. It's all right. It's okay. It's okay. I like I like her a lot. <laughs> ISP, hopefully we'll see uh, some of that stuff and review it in depth, which would be really cool. Uh, looking at these, there's probably going to be an hour video minimum. So sorry for that. Not my fault. If they make it complex. Oh, everything's made in the USA too. Made in the US of A. America. Right. Fuck yeah. <laughs> um, uh, thanks, Shell. Thanks, well, Buck. Well, thanks. Thank you so much. Thanks, whoever. You are, bearded man. Do, did you need a wipe? Do you need a wipe for your cheek? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Wait, wait, wait. We'll, we'll, take, we'll take care of that off camera. We'll get you cleaned up. It'll be all right. Thanks, Adam, for doing the camera. And I still have Robert Baker hair. Oh, uh, your face? that is the word. Ew. Ew. I have pity lips on my, on my face. So. Well, I want to thank you guys for stopping in. I'm just Welcome. so excited that I'm you a fan. guys came in. I'm I'm a fan of you guys, and I had no idea you existed until now. Well, we so, do. Yeah, that is. But we awesome. shall hopefully continue existing. Yay! <laughs> That's actually one of my big plans this year. <laughs> my plan is existing. to not die. As well us. Yes. As, yeah. as well us. We, we um, also do so. so Robert should know how my videos end. You don't know. You've never seen one. Oh no! I'm afraid. Should so, I be afraid? No, no. So. Is he gonna tell them. You Come again? on. Animals at the end. Yes, I you know. don't like you.